Uh, yes, there are at least two returns that would need to be filed in a state proceeding. The first would be the decedent's final income tax return. That return would cover the period from January 1 through the date of death for that particular year. Commencing with the date of death and running through the date in which the estate is closed, uh, the estate may need to file an income tax return for the estate itself. Those are two different forms that are used. The first for the decedent's return would typically be a Form 1040, whereas the return for the estate would be a Form 1041. In addition, if the estate exceeds $5 million in value, it may be necessary to file a federal estate tax return for the estate. That would be filed on a Form 706.